I'm looking at my answer. <laughs> okay, that, that seems like a tie. Hello, my name is Dr. Stefan and welcome back to another RX TV episode. Today I'm really excited to announce that we have two lovely guests over here uh, and it's my honor to introduce Akila. Hello, I'm and Akila. Nikita. Hi. Okay. So as you guys might have noticed, today is a little bit different in terms of our setup. Um, and actually what we're going to do is we're going to have a quiz kind of Ooh. show type of thing uh, where we're going to get you guys to compete. So are you guys competitive? Yeah. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay. So um, the topic today for this RX TV channel is actually going to be about how to make your skin fairer and brighter as well. The tempo of this competition is going to be set by you guys, all right? Um, but just to let you know, uh, not to kind of uh, um, uh, cause any friction between the two of you, uh, <laughs> we're going to have some prizes at the end of this. So whoever racks up the most point will actually leave here today with prize or prizes. Yeah, let's go on to the first question. So the first question... Right, let me just yeah, get Let us there. get ready. Yeah, yeah, just get ready. You've got your boards and everything like that. Question number one, name me two aesthetic treatments that can help with skin brightening. <laughs> I think like Taka Ayam. Can I show okay. my answer now? Right. So Akila, you go first. PRP so got and laser. PRP and laser. And Nikita, if we can have a look at yours as well. Okay, so we've got Pico laser and PRP. All right, so very good start. We've got the same answers. Akila, you're slightly faster uh, going ahead, okay. Um, but these two are both correct answers. Uh, PRP and our laser help with skin brightening. Okay, so question number two. Can you draw me two external factors that causes darkening or aging of the skin? Oops. Just having a... Really? So bad. <laughs> so bad. <laughs> okay. Just because of the speed. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh We're just going to wait for uh, Akila to finish off and we can have a look. Picasso. It's got skills. Not really. Okay. All right. So Nikita, why don't we have a look at yours first? I just put sun okay. and genetics. Okay. All right. Fantastic. Those are both are, those two answers are correct. And Akila, can we look at yours? I've got um, sun as well. Yeah. And um, cigarettes. Okay, so smoking, yeah, cigarettes and smoking. Okay, so all these answers are correct, okay, and the main thing that I want to emphasize is sun. Sun is actually really bad for the skin, so if you're my, one of my clients um, watching out there, um, you've probably heard me tell you hundreds of times that actually sunblock is one of the most important treatments that you can uh, do to prevent your skin from aging and to prevent the harmful effects from sunlight, okay? We've talked about sun, we want to talk about sun protection now. And with regards to sun protection, question number three. Can you tell me what SPF and what PA means? I don't know. <laughs> it's okay, you can try and guess. I'm looking at my answer. <laughs> no pressure, just looking. Should we All right, so yeah, do? Yeah, there we go. go. <laughs> Alright, so why don't we just have a look at both of your answers, okay? So for SPF, you've both got sun protection factor, and then PA, we've got uh, protection uh, effect, advanced, close, protection against, close as well, okay? So basically the sun emits these harmful rays known as UVB and UVA. SPF stands for sun protection factor and what this is doing is it's actually protecting you against UVB. UVB is in, uh, responsible for burning your skin, okay? So we have all these kind of numbers associated with SPF, but the common ones are SPF 15, 30, 50, okay? And essentially, these are kind of blocking up the harmful UVB rays and the number kind of corresponds to how much blockage you get. So just as a kind of a random fact for you guys to know, SPF uh, 30 is the equivalent of blocking about 97% of UVB. And what PA stands for is protection grade of UVA. UVA is essentially something that can uh, damage your skin. So UVA damages the skin by making more wrinkles oh happen, gosh. makes your skin oh more paper-like. It also makes you produce more pigmentation, yeah. so you get kind of all these age spots everywhere. There's a difference between like a physical, chemical sunblock and then also a mineral sunblock. Yeah, right? and basically each one would work differently. One of them is um, a chemical that's going to help to uh, block out 
the rays. Uh, the other one actually has more metal content inside there that actually reflects off the rays, okay? Sometimes people, you know, use SPF 50, SPF 100, and it irritates the skin more. Um, it is actually the metal content inside there is increasing, and that's actually causing more irritation over there. If you're finding your skin gets more irritation from things like SPF 50, then you can actually drop down to SPF 30, SPF 50. Just make sure you're wearing a really thick layer um, so that you get enough coverage and actually that has a similar effect as wearing higher ones, okay? Okay, I got another question, Doctor. Okay. Like, my kids love to swim. Uh-huh. I do apply sunblock for them. Okay. I still get oh, no. super tan, I don't know why. The sunblock will help to prevent you from getting burnt and also prevent the harmful things, but it will not stop you from getting tanned. You will still get tanned as a result of that. There are actually, in fact, some things that can be used or we take orally to actually help to protect our skin against these harmful effects as well, okay? So that's going to bring us on to the next question. Question number four, okay? I want you to tell me which supplement can make your skin fairer and also provide sun protection, okay? So is it A, diamond orange, B, jade pineapple, C, white lemon, or D, crystal tomato? Okay, that, that seems like a tie. The answer is crystal tomato, okay? Um, so crystal tomato is already very well known. Uh, it's one of these really good supplements and one of the first supplements that actually has been able to provide wow. natural sunblock and also to reduce the skin's ability to produce melanin, which makes our skin darker. The Crystal Tomato is actually a very reputable brand as well. And last year in uh, 2020, they actually won the best anti-aging oral supplement of 2020 award um, from Bazaar Beauty. Tomato actually really white. The skin is white and this is actually non GMO, so non-genetically -gen modified. Um, so they actually managed to cultivate this white tomato because of the kind of contents within the skin. The contents inside the skin are something called a carotenoid, awesome. okay? So the carotenoid is something that helps to reduce down our skin's ability to produce melanin, darkening the skin. And it also has some other kind of hey. natural plant extracts and uh, uh, chemicals that actually provides this natural sunblock, okay? The second thing within the kind of crystal tomato is that it has something called L-cysteine and this L-cysteine is a really powerful antioxidant to fight the kind of aging process um, and oxidative stress that causes our skin to age. Um, so not only does it prevent the anti-aging, antioxidants will also help you to um, fight off uh, any toxins in the body, hence boosting up your immune system and glow of the skin as well. Immune system as well. Oh, that's immune great. system as well. Yeah. I think with that. Okay, so this is going to bring us on to our next question, and I want you to draw how many uh, white tomatoes are there inside one tablet of crystal tomato. So if you think that there are 100 tomatoes inside uh, one of those pills, you got to draw 100 tomatoes. Okay, think less. <laughs> Okay, fantastic. Okay. Oh my god. Are you ready as well, Nikita? You are so. Hydro tree. Okay, fantastic. They kind so, of look like Christmas ornament. Yeah, I was going to say, both of yours look a bit like baubles. You need a, you need a Christmas tree. <laughs> so actually, you guys are both correct. Oh, really? <gasps> yeah. There are three inside there. And like I mentioned before, um, all completely natural um, to the point where even pregnant women can take this. So it just yeah, shows how... Ask that question. Yeah, yeah, it just shows how um, kind of safe this um, uh, product is. I think when I was coming into this, I haven't mm -hmm. tried it yet. Mm -hmm. So I was a bit more wary. Okay, okay. Because I'm really scared of like taking any supplements and whatnot. Yeah, yeah. But after like the explanation and okay. the ingredients, now I feel like it's something really interesting to try and I'm looking forward to trying it. Exactly. And I'm really excited to let you guys both know that you are both winners. Hi. This tie in terms of results, okay? All you have to do is take one tablet in the morning um, and you'll be able to see results in terms of kind of skin brightening, uh, skin fairness in two to three weeks. Oh yeah, there will be also a giveaway for three winners. All you have to do is like the video, comment and the most creative comment will win. So that's going to bring us to the end of this video. We really do hope you enjoyed this episode of RX TV. Do remember to like, comment, share, subscribe if you enjoyed it and we'll see you in the next video. Bye! Bye.